In the last episode, we watched the Phantom 4 RTK unboxing together. In this video, I will show you how to set up and activate your Phantom 4 RTK and remote control. Please fully charge all the batteries before activating the drone and the remote control. When the batteries are fully charged, the lights stop flashing as shown green lights in the picture. Then we can now prepare to set up and activate the drone and the remote. The black one is the battery of the remote control. There's a button. When you press it, you can see that battery is fully charged. We now install the battery to the remote control. To flip up the screen, press the button on the left twice and hold for three seconds. Now you see DJI logo shows up. Then you select the system language version. Click next. Please read the DJI user agreement and privacy policy. If no doubt, please click agree. Select Canada, select your region. After the selection is complete, click next. Turn on the Wi-Fi option, select and connect your Wi-Fi network. Click Next after the connection is complete. Select your date and time, click Next. If you don't have a DJI account yet, you can choose Sign Up here to register. After Sign Up, you can enter your DJI account and password, click to log in. After successful login, please activate. Now it shows that device activating is complete. Please click the button Go. Now you select a home app, GSRTK, and choose Always. Please choose to enable each privacy authorization and click Next. Please choose whether to join the product improvement plan. After the selection is complete, the remote control is activated. We will now start to activate the aircraft. First, remove the bracket from the camera and install the battery. You can hear a click. Press the button twice and hold for three seconds. The screen will now display your drone information and request the software updates. Now it shows that the connection is successful. We will talk how to connect your Phantom 4 RTK and a DRTK2 mobile station in the next episode. Okay, my dear friends, please contact us for any questions you might have. And please subscribe our channel and give us a like. And we'll see you next time.